Well, well, how is it going there, ladies and gentlemen? We are switching up a bit this time. We're gonna play some RU, as promised. And I guess I'll just get straight into the team analysis sort of thing. Defensive core is gonna be standard Kobalion with standard Togetic. I guess it's not completely standard. I'm running zero attack Togetic because I don't see the point. I never use Dazzling Gleam or Tri Attack or whatever. I figured, okay, Defog, Heal Bell, Wish, pretty standard. Baton Pass is good just to like pass off the Wish safely, so that Togetic takes the hit as opposed to whatever comes in, you know? And this thing, you know, two attacks here with a Volt Switch for Momentum, Rocks, and Taunt. Three attack Cacturn because it shits all over Sharpedo and I'm not a big fan <laughs> of being swept by Sharpedo. Max speed, max attack. You can easily get behind the sub on like water types as well because of its ability, obviously. And it hits like a truck. Look at that attack stat. Very nice. And the scarf on my team is going to be Delphox. I wanted a fire type and I couldn't think of like a more appropriate fire type scarfer. Well, Typhlosion, I guess. But I didn't want to run that because it's completely standard. And eh, I like Delphox, basically. It has switcheroo as well, which is pretty cool, which I didn't even realize it got, but... The star, hopefully, I don't put too much faith in it, but the star is hopefully going to be a sort of a stunfisk. We gotta believe, people, we gotta believe that it'll do work. Discharge, Scold, Earth Power, Sludge Bomb. So basically, these three are, like, apart from Earth Power, obviously, we got a good chance of inflicting status, and, you know, pretty good coverage as well, I guess. That's for grass types, that is, we got dual stab, and then scold is just good for like other ground types, that sort of thing. It's pretty good. Barbarical, now even though Stunfisk is supposed to be the star of the show, can't help feeling that Barbarical is going to do most of the work. <laughs> shell smash, razor shell, rock slide, x scissor, benefits from the tough claws, and it's good for grass types, so that's why I have x scissor over like EQ or something. White Herb, you know the drill. I might put Jolly on. Let me think about this. Yeah, let's put Jolly on. Might help for some Scarfers. And that is it. So let's get straight on with the battles. Alright. Ooh, you... You big stupid fish. That's gonna be set up bait for Cacturn. Okay, leads we're thinking maybe Jolteon or Drapion. Can't go with Cacturn in case that Jolteon has signal beam. I think Stunfisk leads quite well. Yeah. Like this thing can't you can barely even see Stunfisk's face. Look at it. Look how thin it is. <laughs> I'll just go for Scold. Expecting Claydol? Yeah, boy. That's what I'm talking about. Except it does nothing, but whatever. Okay, how about... Well, he's probably just gonna go for rocks, right? I kind of want to keep going for a burn, to be honest. Toxic, that's not a big deal. I got Heal Bell. And... Yeah, now's a good chance to switch out. There's not much that Claydol can do outside of... Hazards and spinning, really. <laughs> so if we just go for... Heal Bell now, as he toxics again, that's fine. Then Defog, then Baton Pass. Goes to this thing. Watch how little a Jolteon attack will do to Togetic. This thing is ridiculous, honestly. Look at that. That could be like, oh, it's Life Orb, but still. 
That is a very, very nice Spadef stat. I could just go to Delphox, really. Or back to this thing. Whatever. And we will... Eh, let's switch it up and go for a Sludge Bomb in case he goes to Sceptile. Hello. Think Stunfist cares about you, boy? I'm expecting some hacks very soon, don't worry. I can feel it. Oh, whatever. Sludge Bomb again. Drapion. That's a very weird switch. Eh, he could have EQ, I guess. We'll try Togetic. Oh, God. Well, that's not good. <laughs> no, wasn't expecting that. Hmm. Kobalion... I think it could take an EQ. I don't know how much it'll actually do with Sacred Sword. Let's see how much we can do with a Fire Blast. Nothing, apparently. Oh boy! Well, it's not looking good. <laughs> Alright, Kabalian, let's see how well you can take these hits. What? Surely you could have stayed in there. Unless that was like a pity switch, I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. See, I don't think he'll be able to... That did 25%. See, that might be like max damage or something. And I can just set up. Yeah, look. Beast! Love this thing, man. Let's kill it. Well, rest in peace, Delphox, but... At least that Drapion, I'll know what kind of set it is now. Hmm. Drain Point should do a good amount. Eh, I'll take it. I'm trying to figure out what item it would be. I think Lumberry. And if we now go for rocks. Well, up to you, man. <laughs> Bit bizarre that he doesn't have EQ. Okay, bit of damage on this stupid thing. And I think we'll taunt it. Don't burn. God damn it! That's fine. I can Volt Switch in the cat turn. And I know you won't have Ice Beam, because you never have Ice Beam. Boy! Sub again. Jolteon. That is not what I would have gone to. Bitch! God damn, I remember at the start of 5th gen, Cacturn was my worst nightmare. Always swept me. That's back when Absol was in NU as well. And they basically do the same thing, if you think about it. I bet he's that item that gives you more crits. Razor Fang, or... Super Crit Lens, whatever it's called. Alright, Sceptile. I assume it probably has Focus Blast or something. I don't need Kabalion. 
your physical. And apparently you do have an item because that did fuck all. <laughs> I don't know, Vault Switch. Actually, I don't really know how to take this thing on. Because I can't take a leaf blade on this. Well, this is awkward. Try switching back to this. Yeah, it does nothing, whatever. Maybe I should have just gone for Sacred Sword, although it would have done basically nothing anyway, so. Oh, please don't have Substitute. Yes! Thank you. Claw it, sir. I want to believe I can kill it. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about! And this thing can't touch me because I have sub. Yeah, boy. Let's drain some of that HP back. Because this stupid fat fish has a million HP. Yes, yes! Don't know what he's wishing for. Come on, be the good guy. Please forfeit. Oh well, a bit more HP and I'll be able to see bomb. Don't be this guy. C bomb's not gonna kill. That'll do about 40%. There we go, that's enough HP. See how much it does. Oh, not bad. I'll take it. Alright. GG, friend. Oh, I thought I was higher than that, but... You know, still a decent battle. Let's go for the next one. Some FaZe. Imagine FaZe members playing Pokemon. Be some strange shit, man. Right, what do I have? Leads. I don't know, Jolteon or Frostless. Boom. Well, Jolteon. See how you like a blast of fire! Work up. I don't know what to expect. Uh-huh. I doubt he'll stay in, so we'll go for a sludge bomb. He does stay in, and he has hyper voice. Right. Oh, stored power. Now that's interesting. I was thinking about running Synchronoise on a Jolteon, just for like other electric types, but that'd be a bit stupid. Just tank that hit. Look at that, look. 28% from a Yan Mega. As banter of the highest order. Alright, well, GG. Let's go for another. <laughs> 